Hi, my name is Abrar and welcome to SyncWave.pro. You know what? I saw so many people on my Facebook, on my Instagram, or even on my live, they are considering Apple's ecosystem is superior. In my perspective, Apple ecosystem is good enough, but this is not the only one reason you should buy any Apple devices. For example, I have two devices. Both of the devices are Android. Now, should I throw these two devices into dustbin? Actually not. Because just like Apple AirDrop, you can now use near drop this is a third party plugins that you can install on your macbook device and after that you can receive any files from your android device and this is absolutely free no charts excited let's get started right now we are in the macbook so at the very first open your browser and search for near drop at the very first you will see Griska Neardrop. So Neardrop is the software name and Griska is the developer of that particular software. I'm sorry if I pronounce the name wrong way. <laughs> anyway, click on the first link. This particular website link you can find on the description box below. After scroll down and click on releases. From here click on the assets and click the neardrop.app.zip. So it will start downloading. After download the file just open it. Now click on near drop. If you also find this error, don't worry. Just click on the OK button and open your settings. From here, scroll down and go to privacy and security. Again, scroll down, click on open anyway to allow the near drop. Now click on open. So as you can see, near drop has been installed on my laptop. Now simply open your phone then open your specific folder or photos that you want to share on your macbook for example i will use photos then i'll go to library and i want to select this all photos and videos after that click on the share icon scroll down now here you will see many options for example quick share realme share or stuff like that so click on the share icon sorry i forget to mention you must need to allow the Bluetooth option as well the location. Now as you can see my MacBook has been found on my phone so I will tap on it. On your MacBook go to notification and allow the near drop options and that's it. As you can see it started transferring my files into my MacBook. Open finder and then go to downloads as you can see my selected photos and videos is on my macbook without any cables or even buying a single app before the video ends i wanna say the transfer speed is not same as the apple airdrop don't expect that much but this is a very good app now let me know what do you think about the software all right thank you so much for watching this video if you are new to the channel please make sure to hit that subscribe button now most importantly if you are a content creator or if you want to become a content creator then please visit syncweb.pro because we are offering everything for example long form videos short form videos podcast editing or even making thumbnails for your videos for more info please read our description box peace